if it took for me to have to go through just to get you to listen, then job is done. I am so happy to have made it to this point by the grace of God to be able to share a life experience, no matter how horrible, how scary, or how troubling it may have been, to bring something to the table that probably otherwise would not have made it to the table has made me feel more confident than ever that the that things are moving in the right way, the way they're supposed to. I've learned God is using me in a way that he probably haven't used me before. If he have, then <laughs> God bless. Because guys, when I tell y'all I had no intentions of using technology, no intentions of being on a YouTube channel or anything technical like that. If this is what it came to, then so be it. The intuitions that I have don't really be respected until you have no other choice but to respect it, even though if you never choose to then you already know the truth when Sean G bring it because that's all I can bring is the truth not only on YouTube but outside of YouTube as well but it has definitely been a pleasure to come here in whatever state that I am mentally, physically, <laughs> emotionally, psychologically, spiritually if I ain't say it that already, I'll say it again if I didn't. Um, it definitely have been one, guys. Um, and thank God for putting things in perspective. Things are moving. When I tell y'all, things are moving. Things are really moving. <laughs> All the thing I have to do now is sit back. And just allow the Lord to help me finish the rest. And I know it's going to take him to help me to do that. Because I'm known to get in my own way. But this time, I know he set me down for a reason. <laughs> I'm going to make you so tired that you ain't going to be able to do nothing. And that's exactly what this road has been, guys. You can't do everything, no matter how much you try. You can never do everything. Some things you will have to leave alone and allow God to do what He, what you asked him to do for you along the way. So whatever this next chapter is, I'm ready. And uh, I'm ready to embrace it as well, guys. Because this one here, I was ready to close it before it even started to be written. But again, it's okay, guys, because that's the way the good Lord has made it. And I hope and I pray throughout this time, guys, that God uplift y'all spirits and uh, encourage y'all as well for whatever it is that you guys may face or whatever it is you guys may be going through. If one person can take and tell their stories truthfully, I believe it will open a lot more doors for others to feel comfortable enough. Even if you're not comfortable, be brave enough to open up and start sharing your story as well. Because I think that's when you will begin to get around the right kind of people, people like you. It ain't for everybody. It don't supposed to be for everybody. But for those that it, it is, that's where, your, <laughs> that's where your help from each other going to come from. That's where your uplifting 
with each other is going to come from. So guys, don't be scared. Don't hesitate. Don't even start thinking what somebody else may think, feel, or got to say about you. Because at the end of the day, it's your life. And it ain't nobody else's business but you and God's business. Unless you want the rest of the world to know just how brave you really are, regardless to what the situation and circumstances may be. It's okay, guys. But you have to okay things in your life, even when they're not okay. You're going to have to do something. You can't stay at a standstill. So why not take that leap of faith and start your journey? Because at the end of the day, it is your journey. And you get to tell your story. Don't sit back and let somebody else tell your story when you have the means to tell your own story. You know your truth, regardless to what. So never, ever let anything or anybody else dictate you, your moves, or anything else that goes on with your life. If you know that what you're doing or what you're trying to do is the best thing that you can do, not only for you, but extending that olive branch to try to help somebody else. All right, guys. That's just Sean G on here talking. Some real truth. And uh, I continue on with my truth as God will have me to be. Thank you guys again for tuning in to another one of my videos. I really, really appreciate it, guys. You guys know that I never want to leave my videos without leaving it on a pop. pop. <coughs> I get stuck up with that word every single time. I never want to leave my videos without leaving it on a positive note. And you guys know the word that I use is power. So I'll take the P for pressure. I'll take that auto release that pressure. But I want to share the OWE with you guys because you owe it to yourselves to be the best you you can be. And remember, God loves you. And I love my fam too. And I'll see you guys on my next video. Until then, guys. You guys stay safe out there. God bless.